It's the final day in the PlayStation 4 National Premier League's Victoria and Ballarat Red Devils travel to Oakley's Jack Edwards Reserve with a simple equation. Win and they would avoid relegation. The Red Devils had beaten Melbourne Knights 2-0 to keep their hopes of survival alive while Oakley Cannons off the back of a 2 all draw with South Melbourne would at least exit the season knowing they had not been beaten by the eventual NPL champions. Ballarat knew that losing this game, combined with a draw between their fellow relegation battlers Werribee City and Port Melbourne, would result in them being relegated. A draw, though, not the worst result, given Ballarat's advantageous goal difference situation. So would second-placed Oakley take their foot off the pedal on the final day? Teo Pelizzeri with you for the highlights of this match. Let's go to the action. Ball to Lukonu, the centre of defence. Ball's bobbling and Agwek will catch him in possession. Agwek breaking to the left. And now cutting onto his right. Round Chromitis and shooting. And it's curling into the arms of Honos. Throw in finds D'Angelo. Down the line. Bosniak. Clever back here to D'Angelo. Now sweeping crossfield pass. Christodoulou is there. Foster. Appealing for offside, but Foster's all right. Back to Kakari. Now Christodoulou, edge of the area on the left. And shooting it wide at the near side. Boys, everyone's got to do a job. Boys. Come on, man. Come on, Under pressure. Playing a through ball. Might work out here. And off his line, Honos has done well, and Honos is hurt. It's an open net. Oakley desperately trying to clear the ball. Salvatore will keep it in the attacking third for Ballarat. And now Harding takes possession. Breaking into the area. Harding crossing. It spills. Harvey! And he's put it over the bar from point blank range. It may be bobbling on the pitch, but Harvey really should have scored. Honos coming out of his line looks injured. It was a great run into the area by Harding. Squaring it. It's set up perfectly for Harvey. And the ball just taking an uneven bounce. He was unable to keep it down. What a chance for the Ballarat Red Devils. And things looking serious for Honos here. He's getting extensive treatment from the Oakley physio, Luda Lavadure. Firth to Salvatore. Breaking wide to the left. Keeps the ball in. Good touch. Salvatore hits the byline and crossing through the area. Harding! And he fires wide at the target. And maybe he should have done better. The chances are starting to rack up for the Ballarat Red Devils. It was electric speed from Salvatore down the left. And his cross into the area, finding an unmarked player. But Harding couldn't put it on the target. Kokari. Wide to the left. And he's been intercepted. King coming through. And now driving forward for Ballarat. Playing it to Harding. Right corner of the area. Good challenge coming in. Turns Harding away. Back to the flank. Crossing into the area. Cleared by D'Angelo. Only as far as remain. Ballarat Red Devils maintaining possession. White to Harding. Drifting it into the area. A quick volleying it. And sending the shot well wide. Pass into the attacking half. Well read, coming away with the ball. Harding driving it forward. Harvey, the header down. Agwek is there. Lakornu heads away. Harding again. Lakornu with another header. Now it's Liam Harding. He's trying his luck, putting it high and wide from well outside the area. Lakornu, the centre of defence for Oakley. Plays it wide to the right. Come out. Backwards halfway. And now a good pass. Christodoulou switching flanks. Bosniak is there. Top left corner of the area. Deflected. And it's well held by Remain. Hit long by Remain. Deep into the attacking half. Dancing at the top of the area. And that one is easy for Honos. Honos is going to send it back just as long. Bosniak up in the air, nods it down. Foster leaving it for Bosniak with a shot, and it's a good save, parried, and then caught by Remain on the follow-up. Good technique from Bosniak there to control the ball and take the shot on the bobbling surface. 
and Remain equal to the task, making a good stop. Here's Remain over the free kick. Swinging it to the top of the area, comfortably cleared. As far as Swinton though, breaking past Corrali, and it's held by Honos. Clever volley, there's the ball. Bouncing it halfway. And now Christodoulou hits it into the attacking half. It might work out here. Bosniak with the shot! And it's Oakley in front! And that goal puts the Ballarat Red Devils into the relegation zone. It could be such an important strike in the context of the season. With just under half an hour to go, it's Oakley Cannons 1, Ballarat Red Devils 0. It was an ambitious kick from Christodoulou. He just punted it forward and it bounced perfectly into the path of Bosniak. Ballarat, as things currently stand, must score or they will be relegated. And so with word of that Werribee goal, it does mean it's Port Melbourne in the drop zone. Ballarat going in search of some insurance. Swinton gets around Corrali into the area. Sadler with the challenge, shouts for a penalty. Not paid and Sadler clears his lines. Swinton did so well to get around Corrali into the penalty area and it was a decent shout Sadler sliding in and timing his challenge to perfection Can Ballarat score Here comes the corner to the back post over everyone's head Salvatore will keep it in Red Devils possession wide on the left to the back post Murphy's unmarked and Horos tips it over the bar Great save by the Oakley goalkeeper and showing none of the signs of that injury that we were worried about in the first half. Murphy had to generate a lot of power from some way out, but it was a good header on the target and Honos has denied him with a fingertip save. Wilford. Foster. Thompson left the ball behind. Foster is dashing through. Top of the area, squaring it. Here's a chance for Wilford and it's batted away by Romain. What an odd passage of play. The Ballarat defence stops thinking they've given away a foul. And Wilford's attempt on target and needing a very good save from Remain. Here's Remain over the free kick. Swings it to the penalty spot. Header through the penalty area. All right, retaining possession initially. And now breaking away. Kremitis into the attacking half. Oakley on the break here. Kremitis wide on the right, plenty of time to pick a target in the area. It's Foster totally unmarked and scoring the second. And Ballarat's fate now rests in the hands of Werribee. Nate Foster makes it Oakley Cannons 2, Ballarat Red Devils 0. It was a loose touch at the top of the area and a poor pass that set Kremitis free. He raced into the attacking half and Nate Foster so lethal around goals and once again able to find himself totally unmarked he is an expert at losing defenders and it was a simple finish when the ball arrived watch him, watch him, watch him, watch him. That ball. they won't get to take the throw that's the full time whistle and now Ballarat faces a nervous wait to find out if Werribee City can hold on against Port Melbourne it was the 92 minute mark at JL Murphy Reserve when the full time whistle went at Jack Edwards. It left the Ballarat players with a nervous four minutes listening to the dying stages of Port Melbourne versus Werribee City. Port Melbourne, maybe one last chance. Here goes Honos, running at the defence. Goes through oh, Filipovic, into the area. Honos, oh, tees up oh, the equaliser. They have done it. They have done it. Goal for Port Unbelievable. Melbourne. Unbelievable. Last second equaliser, Connor Redden. Would you believe it? He scored. Unbelievable. Honos ran through them like they were turnstiles. He went through four players, teed up the goal, and Connor Redden with the easiest tap-in of his career. It's 1-1. Three points, a good way to finish the season. Yeah, definitely. Um, we, you know, we want to obviously continue this momentum into next year. So, you know, 
losing today or a draw, you know, it's just not good enough. So um, wanted to end uh, a really good season on a high, and yeah, what better way to do it than in front of the home fans? Uh, well, there's a dejected group of players and myself and everybody to do with this football club. It's a cruel way, but it's football. You love it and you hate it at the same time once you're heavily involved in it. But it's not just a, it's a culmination of not just one game, it's 26. So we just missed the boat this time. So yeah, we take and we'll do a big review. Of where where we've been, where we're at, and go from there. But what do you say to the players? I imagine they must be absolutely distraught right now. Oh, definitely yes. Uh, I'm immensely proud of that squad of players because backs up against the wall right from the very start. But that's that's where we're at, where we've come from. So never stopped all the way, all through the nine months of the season. Never gave up. Kept on pushing. Kept on challenging. And yeah, just immensely proud of them.